This is a series of videos. Please refer to methods of stitches, ignoring the yarn color. Select the corresponding yarn colors in your material package to learn. Please refer to both the videos and the instructional brochure during your crocheting process. Please make sure to first view the beginning 10 instructional videos to learn the basic methods of crocheting, and then view the instructional videos for your purchased product. Little Monster's Legs Start with a magic ring. Use the thicker end of the hook. In round 1, start with one chain stitch, then work 6 single crochets. Insert hook into the magic ring, yarn round hook and pull it through the ring. Yarn round hook and pull through the loop on hook. That's a chain stitch. Then work 6 single crochets. Insert hook into the magic ring. Hook the yarn and pull up a loop through the ring. There are two loops on the hook. Yarn around the hook and pull through both loops on the hook. That's a single crochet. Place a marker in the first stitch. Such a V-shape stands for one stitch. Continue to finish the remaining 5 single crochets. Six single crochets are finished. Pull the yarn tail to close the ring. Work one slip stitch in the market stitch. Insert hook into the first stitch. Underneath this V, hook the yarn and pull up a loop not only through the stitch, but also through the original loop on the hook, that's snip stitch. Beginners are recommended to watch basic tutorial videos and practice basic stitches with a practice yarn in the kit. In round 2, start with a chain stitch, and then work 6 increases. Increase means working 2 single crochets in one stitch. One single crochet is done. Place a marker in the first stitch of each round. Work one more single crochet in the same stitch. Then one increase is done. Continue to work the remaining five increases.
work slip stitch in the first stitch. In round three, starting with a chain stitch, we work set of three single crochets, one increase for three times. One set is done, work two more sets. Work slip stitch in the first stitch. Round 3 is finished. Stretch the loop, break yarn, and pull the yarn tail out. Conceal the yarn tail inside the fabric.